What's going on, Paladins Gamers? This is Paladins, and I am Underdog, and this is Lifesteal Moji. We're going to be playing Moji, who is a very overpowered flank champion with full lifesteal full life steel build. I am very dehydrated right now. Holy poop. Uh, let's just get into the breakdown of the abilities, um, which sound more complicated than they actually are, alright? She's got a basic spit damage, uh, it's kind of like breathing fire is the best way I would explain it, and, uh, based on damage you place stacks of quote-unquote magic mark, magic mark is like her passive, uh, so you place stacks by spitting out your range damage. So you've got a spray of fire, a ranged spitting attack, which can crit and do like a thousand damage. So um, basically you're just hitting people, building stacks, and then hitting them again and popping them like a balloon. All you need to know is she can fire two things at once constantly. And it's very annoying. She does crazy damage. Uh, she's also got a magic barrier, which makes her invincible, and based on your build, you can heal during it, you can, uh, regain ammo during that, you can do a lot of stuff. Uh, and then she has scamper, which is just a movement speed dash. She just dashes forward. Uh, there's a couple things that increase that. Um, she doesn't use ammo. Well, you're right. She doesn't. Well, she does something. She does something when she's uh, using Magic Barrier. Anyway, and then uh, Bone Appetite is where she casts an arcane spell that transforms a single enemy into a tree. And then she eats that tree, which is basically... It's like a polymorph plus an execution. Uh, so that's cool. And they can't be revived. Like, Terminus, for example, can't be revived at the point of death when he's executed. Uh, her talents are Snack Attack. When you get an elimination, you drop a health pack that heals uh, the champion who picks it up. Uh, they're only visible to allies. I don't know why that would matter, but there you go. Uh, then you've got Boom Boom, which detonates Magic Mark. Also damages all enemies within the area. Uh... 75% of the damage so this just increases your passive with the magic mark allows you to do more damage to the rest of the team and not just a single target this seems okay but I think her best talent is actually toot which allows her to heal allies while using the scamper so she can run around and heal her friends uh, the build today, of course, is full life steal. So four points into symbiotic, four points into harmonious, four points into greater good, one point into fluffy, two point into shimmering. You already know the build if you were here last time because we were talking about it and why it works. And let's just play the game. Let's just freaking play the game. How about that? Let's get into awesome. it, gamers. Select your champion. Customize your champion. All that matters is we press all the buttons. Press all the buttons. If she doesn't have ammo, then what, she, what can she regain during barrier? Cooldowns, maybe? I don't know. I know there's one that increases the amount of health she regains while she's doing it. Right? But that seems pretty basic. None of her cards are really that crazy anyway, so... I think I'll be using the ally heal talent today for the most part. Hey, and then we might try Boom Boom, I guess, later on. 
But it's not going to matter. It's not going to matter because this character is broken, so... We gain lifesteal. Off of the magic mark. Here's my range damage. Here's my close damage, which actually has pretty decent range on it. Here's my scamper. Here's my barrier. And then I guess you'll see the ult eventually. So we're gonna... A uh, big part of this build Five, today is to put four, points into uh, three, two, tier 1, one kill to and heal so and tier 1 life rip. So we want kill to heal and life rip no, for this build it. to be really good. We're going full life steal today. Hello, Buck. How are you? Let's just run around and heal the team. That was a clone, wasn't it? Woo! There's a Maldamba on the point and a Yaragoth down there too. I mean, I, he does a lot of damage, but is it enough damage to take out Yaragoth? I guess we're gonna find out here. I'm hitting the crits, I just need the rest of the team to focus here. Who plays Bomb King? Ah! <laughs> How is it every time we play Paladin, somebody's playing like an F tier champion? I don't understand. Alright, well, Yaragoth's focusing me. Alright, I got him off the point. He's rolling in place. He doesn't know what's happening. I'm gonna scurry over here. Heal the team while I'm doing that. Up, just drop down, kill him, get rid of that. I'm so used to having to reload, it's weird having infinite ammo. I think that's what it was. When I said that earlier, about how she needs ammo, I guess I forgot. Or I, I haven't played her in a while, so... Um, forgot how broken she actually is. I think I killed him before I hit that ult, so my ult dropped, but it doesn't matter. He's dead, and that's all we need. We're gonna try to scurry after this buck, get him with the fire, spit on him, get that mark. Protect the team, holy poop, there's a lot of things happening. Oh yeah, we do crazy damage, by the way. Did I mention, did I mention that she does crazy damage? Kill the team, push in. We ain't dying today. Oh no. Scurry around here, scamper over there. Where they are, God. Go. Did he roll away or did he die? I'm not interested in your wind up, dude. See ya. Thanks for coming. Uh, try not to die here. Something around. We want to focus all our attacks on the Yaragoth, just keep them down as long as possible. Where'd you go? You jumped away. Stay on point. Get that capture. Stay invincible. Hurry away! Oh, they got me that time. All right. Uh, so yeah, we're just building into kill to heal and life rip until we can't spend any more points And then I guess morale boost for the ult charge but Those are pretty much all you need on Moji here He's a plank champion, so I guess we should try to go around the team
Oh, okay. What the heck? This guy's flying all over the place. I think Buck actually got a range shot on me. That's impressive. Enemy killing spree. That's impressive. Try to kill this original Yang here. Oh! I think he reflected before I even hit that all. That's unfortunate. Uh, I still have it though. Okay, we're good, we're good. Eat that shit, boy! Yummy! Yummy, yum, yum! You tasted like a snack! You saw that? I turned him into a little underdog treat. Ate him for one. Oh shit, there's the Maldamba ult. We're gonna have to scurry out of here. The barrier should keep me immune from that, right? I mean, I can just run out of the area's effect anyway. Uh oh. Oh, he was, uh, Buck was behind me on the stairs. Enemy rampage. So yeah, we're gonna put points in morale boost so I can get that alt back up and just execute whoever wants to play. Man is just running right at me, which is not a good idea. Um, I tried to ult the Yaragos, but I think I might have died while doing it. So I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I can. I should be able to ult him while he's in stationary form, right? That shouldn't matter. Because I think when they're the tree, they actually can hop around for a second. And you have to like run over them before you actually consume them in your ult. But usually they just drop right in front of you, so it's not like it matters. It's not like they can escape, really. And the range of her ult is like two feet in front of her face, so you kind of have to do it in front of somebody anyway. Dude, this fuck is the problem, man. Yaragos just executed somebody. Get this fuck off me! Get the buck off me, dude! Mm. See, I'm 21 and 3 right now. Just keeping tabs that uh, we were wrecking, but unfortunately we lost. So that's it. I mean, this is the most cut and dry example of playing and playing a powerful champion in a very effective way. Because we're doing so much damage. And we're just getting a small percentage of health back based on every shot. And we just keep going and keep going. And it's hard to tell uh, how many stacks of magic mark you have. But. I mean, with the 20, with the 24% life steal. Doesn't even matter. Plus, we're reducing damage after the magic barrier ends. Plus, we're increasing the healing when we're low health. Plus, we already have an increased health of 50. And then we're reducing the cooldown of magic barrier by a second. Just so I can stay alive even longer. We just don't... The goal is not to die with this build. I mean, every time you play Paladins, that should be the goal, right? Mm, 
So yes, there is a new champion coming out soon. Uh, his name is Vatu. I believe he's a flank champion, right? He's got a lot of range. He basically puts out a line and can teleport across the map and select. He stuns everybody with that ult. So it's kind of like he's a mix between Customize I would say if you champion. play Smite, he's a mix between Mercury and Tsukiyomi where he's got like ranged attacks and his ult just dashes through everybody. Uh he looks fun. Looks fun. Looks like he can just blink all around and be one of those really annoying champions okay, that people ready. just have to deal with. Speaking about annoying champions, I think our issue in this matchup is Rom. Uh, Moji does a lot of damage, but Rom can gain health back. He's got a shield build he could have. He's very tanky front line. Does a lot of damage as well. I think Rom is really good right now. And uh, so we're going to have to try and focus everybody else besides Rom. That should be my goal in this match no, up here. We don't eat them. We're going to go with Toot. And then maybe later today in the stream we'll do Boom Boom. But I think uh, I want to help out the team a little bit because I'm a nice guy. I'm a nice, friendly, helpful player. The battle is about to begin. What's the na what's the name of the pet that she rides on? The little two-headed turtle. What's the name of it? Mr. Fluffy or something? I know it's got a specific name, and she says it all the time, and now I forget. Five, four, three, Mr. Bigglesworth. Two, That's definitely one. not it. <laughs> Point has spawned. The battle has begun. First blood. Uh oh, somebody's AFK. Uh oh. I mean, I mean, somebody's not playing. That's not good. Oh, I'm just dead. I'm just dead. I'm just dead. <clears throat> I'm just dead. We got a Tiberius with his ult already. Oh, shoot, dude. We got a pro Tiberius on our team right now. Who am I playing next? It's gonna have to be a front line, right? We did damage, then this is flank. So, yeah, it has to be front line. I think maybe Ruckus. Because Ruckus is like on the bottom of the list, so we'll probably just play Ruckus next time. That sounds like a very boring stream to me, but hey, you know what? You gotta do it. You gotta do what you gotta do, kids. We need a good clickbait title for the next video as well. Wow, dude, I just, she stunned me with that grab. She wretched my soul. I will pass judgment. Don't I got your back. <sighs> Nap time's over. Get up. Get oh my God! They've got perfect aim. Somebody on that team has perfect aim. The only way that makes any sense. I think it's serious. Don't stop. Gaze into the abyss. This serious is on a roll here. 
Point spawner in 15 seconds. Oh, I'm just dead. Dash in, got headshotted immediately by the Aya. Shoot me again. See what happens. Get them away. Run through the team and heal them. Oh, I'm gonna die. Eat her. Woo, boy, she tried to jump away. You saw that? That little doggy tree was running. I got her though. Get on to the point, let's go. We need these. We need all of these. Get this ROM out of here! Have to play my role. Take the people off of the sides. Point spawning in 15 seconds. Just try and touch it. <laughs> Point has spawned. I think the magic mark is the star over their head. I think that's what it is. Mm hmm. Cause some of them have a star over their head. I've been wondering what that is. I believe that might be the passive or the magic mark. But it doesn't tell me how many stacks I have of it. Unless it's like a really small visual indicator. Oh, I think it like builds up. Right? It like builds up to the amount of stacks you can have. Yeah, okay. It's like a clock, almost. And then when you're done, it's a full glowing star. I still have my target. I gotta spend these shiny things. Howie, that hurts. I guess the idea when you have that other talent is if you see somebody with a glowing star over their head, that's where you try to hit them again. <laughs> Just hit them again. What a strategy, Paladin. Tune in that shit. Get out of here. There's too many enemies. Not having as good as a round this time. They can't all be gold. No! Oh, I didn't catch him! That sucked. He should be dead here in a second. Uh, well, I didn't get the snack. I wanted that snack, but he bounced away. So yeah, they do have a chance to escape. Oh, there's the thousand. Yeah, you get you hit for a thousand automatically when you have a full mark on them, which is crazy. That's crazy, dude. It's just a free crit to their head. This is the closest thing to like actual critical strike in Paladin. Look at that. Oh. Oh, dude, that's gross. That is gross. This is a flank champion that has this passive. Just so you recognize. Uh, not damage. She's not damage, but she's doing crazy damage. Oh, I was just about to dash and heal the team. Damn it. 
Let's get points into morale boost so I can get my ult back up here. Try to just eat that Io. I want to find that Io. Get their healer out of the game. Bro, get out of here. You're dead. Uh, if I can't see, I can't really alter. Ah, oh, yum, 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 yum. Hey, the ROM was there. I had to do it. The ROM's probably going to be the easiest one to ult, just because he's going to be in the middle of everyone. You can just run in and grab him. And the IO's going to be, like, in the back line somewhere. So I got to try to flank around and find her next time. My barrier was down, I was dead. Do this. I don't know what else I would get. Uh, like maybe just movement speed or carterize. Nothing else is really that important for Moji. Yeah, they have double healers. I got Cirrus and Io. So I think that's why they're doing good here. And they're about to win, man. Gotta get them off the point, guys! I think this person played Buck, assuming that he's a frontline. Because we don't have a tank, and we kind of needed one. No! I was stunned for so long! That's serious stun, man. We just played her recently, too. That stun is really good. Probably the best part about Cirrus is that she can just... Hit you once, Defeat. and then press the button, and you're gone. You're like stuck in place forever. <laughs> it's literally like a four-second stun. It's kind of crazy. Ugh, that's rough. It's like I feel like I'm doing good, and then we just lose at the very end, based on like a team comp or something. And we're doing a lot of self-healing and team healing. Uh, so this 7,722 7, healing, I believe, is from my pa uh, my talent here. The toot. I don't think it's taking it, my lifesteal into account. So just by using the scamper to heal allies... We're doing like 7,000 healing a game, which is not, it's not a lot, but it's something, you know, just an extra little boost that the team might need. And this other talent... The, when you hit the thousand damage uh, detonation on the magic mark, it also damages all enemies within 15 units. So that, that's a pretty small range. They have to be in the group. But if there's a bunch of people on a point or an objective, for 75% of its damage? What's 75% of a thousand? A lot. That's the that's the mathematical equation there. A lot. It's gonna Select hurt people. Your champion. 
Customize your champion. Let's do the green turtle. Ride right into battle. On my trusty steed. I think what makes her so dangerous is the fact that she okay, doesn't ready. use ammo and she never needs to reload. She's got infinite and she just... You're just always shooting that ranged thing. You always have a chance to get that detonate hit. It's almost guaranteed. Like, unless you miss, but it's pretty hard to miss with her. You just need, like, half decent uh, half decent aim. With the ranged attack, with the ranged spit, and you're good. That's it. Okay, they have a Terminus front line. And we have an Ash. That's a golden Terminus, dude. This guy, this guy's a Terminus main, and I respect it after that nerf. This is good to see. Uh, I think Terminus has always been, hey, like, up, you lazy my favorite. He's just so good. Let's try the detonation. I want to see how good this is. We'll do that. We'll do the uh, boom boom. Bada boom. <laughs> just going to make that detonation... Even larger. Do damage to the allies, or the do damage to the enemies in the area of it. What skin is this? I don't know, but I'm looking at it, boys. I'm oh, I'm looking. I'm seeing some things. Five, four, <laughs> three, two, one. Have fun. And so it begins. Uh, okay. Okay, Koga. My whole team got wiped in three seconds. Got all the swords. I knew you'd have Why does it look like my ash is aiming way too high? That just me? That's the camera angle? Okay. Yeah, this Koga knows, man. He knows Enemy to focus me. Enemy behind us. If only we had on my way. Healer. On my way. Doing her job. Wow. Alright. Two hit me. Two tap. You're already dead. Enemy double kill. Ouch. He reflected that. Oh, I'm getting wiped. Wipe like a butt. Them. Thank you for the ult. 
He's using this beam offensively, which means he's not playing as a healer. And I understand that, as Furia. Like, you don't really need to, but it would have been nice to have healing on her team. An enemy I know the Willow ain't doing shit. I just know. My own is almost ready though. Dude, this guy is just like dodging everything. Dodge, how do you dodge fire at a close range? Let me know. That's pretty impressive. Dude, this guy's like AFK and I can't even kill him. Help! <laughs> this is a bad game. So, wait, I, the, somebody ulted me and it gave the kill to the Koga who didn't even hit me. Enemy triple kill. Something fishy's going on with this Koga. Just getting kills out of nowhere. Eat him! Yeah, revive after that, bitch! Terminus Saint coming back after that one. Now, if only I could do that to one of their flanks. They don't really get to see how good this uh, boom boom trait is unless they're in a group. And they're definitely not gonna group up with this comp, so. I just don't, I don't know if this is really that useful to me right now. Oh, there he goes. Ah, I tried to dash out of it. Thought I would have time. My light flickers. Life rip. Kill to heal. I'm gonna sit here in the corner and wait. We see our target. Oh my god. Oh my good lord. This might be the worst game I've had in a while. None of my plans are working and nobody wants to work with me. That's what we needed. You actually can gain points while you're up here, which is really good. There's a really good place to just like sit and work. But you have to be ready for these guys up here. He didn't dodge that time. Thank you for the stun, Ash. No problem. Or I mean, Furia, sorry. We have both, so I guess maybe they both helped me there. Killing spree. 
Eat it. Eat it. Control my destiny. Incinerate them. Let's go. Oh, wait, he can reflect that. Victory. But he can't win if he can't get to the point. So, there we go. I played like shit, and I win. I play great, and I lose. This game is just backwards. <laughs> uh. Makes no sense! <laughs> uh, I didn't really get to see the full effect of that talent, so I can't say... I can't speak on how good it actually is. I feel like it might be a situational talent. And scam healing with Scamper is just always useful. And then healing after elimination, like, sna for the snack attack talent, you already have an in-game item that does that. Does it say his name? No, it doesn't. All right, we're going to Google this. I thought it was Mr. Fluffy, but it might be something else. Moji Paladin's pet. Uh, <laughs> the first thing is too much damage. <laughs> it just says it does too much. People are just complaining. <laughs> Moji and friends. Familiar, uh, doesn't he, doesn't it have a name? Her pet is creepy. Yeah, but what's the pet's name? Recent thoughts on Moji. This character does too much damage rant. And then there's a Reddit rant that goes on forever. Puppy Rider. Top... Champions for beginners. I'm not going to look at who's on this list. I'm going to guess. Hold on. Uh, let me go to all. Top champions for beginners. I'm going to guess that on this list, it's Barrick, Victor, Kinesa, um, Vivian, and... Who else is really easy? I mean, they're all... They're all easy, really. Nobody that's, like, super difficult. Let's see. Who's the number one champion for beginners? Vivian. <laughs> Vivian. Uh, Moji's on this list. Yeah, I agree. Moji's really simple. Just press a couple buttons and... You're fine. Vivian is the number one. That's kind of funny. I knew she would be there.
Ooh. <laughs> All right, let's play another onslaught, and we got like five five games of siege, and maybe we'll end with a death match or something. Onslaught. Select a champion. Customize your champion. Mergy. How come one is like angry and the other one's derpy? That's how all twins are. <laughs> Boom, roasted. No front line. Why do we have no front line? Okay, I'm ready. Whose fault is this? I'm surprised I see Zen a lot because I never thought he was that good, but I guess if he has the ability to reflect an attack directly at you, that's pretty useful. They have an Octavia. So, we expect... When you're playing Octavia, you always pick the passive of ult charge. Always. That's the new meta. Why would you not? Why would you not give your team increased ult charge? Like, there's just no reason not to do that. So, that's kind of the current meta right now. It's just getting... Get people with the best ults, and then an Octavia. So they have a Moldamba, they have an Ash, and I would say Cirrus' Cirrus's ult has potential to be good, but you kind of have to use it at exactly the right time. It's like an opportunity ult. It gives you an opportunity, but you also have to use it at the right opportunity, right? Because it's kind of, um, the Cirrus ult, who we played last time, is kind of similar to um, Zarya from Overwatch. Where she, she shoots an orb out and it will pull people to it. It's like a gravitational pull to the area. But the the area of effect is not that big. So you kind of have to aim it at a group of people for it to really work. And you kind of need... You need your team to like do something no, we don't after that. Eat them. You know? They're friends. So let's try Boom Boom again. Of course, this is the build today. Full life steal emoji, which means we need kill to heal and life rip. Oh boy! And my base health is 2250. That's because I have one point that gives me 50 more health. It's not much more, but it's enough to uh, just help. Help me stay alive for that much longer. Help. Five, four, three, Area two, protected. one. Point has spawned. Let the battle begin. First blood. Oh, somebody just fell off the map. Go play flank, shall we? Do, 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 do. Don't mind me. Oh, this person definitely saw me. How come the Maldomba is the one that saw me? I tried to scamper back, but I don't think it works midair. 
I don't think so. We can try to jump off of something and scamper and see if I go forward, but I don't think that's exactly how this works. Excuse me, Vora. Oh, it's King of the Hill. The spawn points are moving. The uh, capture points are moving, I mean. Oh, it does kind of work a little bit. All right, uh, the capture point's upstairs there. Enemy killing spree. Okay. Hello? I don't have the thing that lets me break through shields. Somebody else has got to help me with this ash. I might have to get Wrecker. Yeah, I guess we're good. We'll put at least one point into it. I didn't want to do that, but it feels like I have to do that in this game. Ultimate is ready. Point spawning in 15 seconds. Get a couple points while we're here, guys. Thank you for the heals. I appreciate that. Okay. I don't know why the Maldombo ran into the team. Octavia ult kind of... Don't understand how it completely missed me, but all right. I got... I also got, like, more ult there, which was weird. Or I got grabbed. By the Zen. I don't know what else. That was weird. I like got ulted and grabbed at the same time. It was very awkward. I can't ult her while she's in her ult, so we have to wait till this ult is gone. Oh, I missed! That sucks. I did it and she like punched me backwards, which is what she does. Ash is. I think one of the best front lines just simply because her whole kit is about knockback. Like, sending the team off of the point. Which is all you really need to do. Paladin's is really about positioning. Oh my gosh, look, look at that knockback, dude. It's wild. And then she just charges into me. Point spawning in 15 seconds. I don't know how she got me through a wall, but all right. Ah, this is not looking good. This is looking like my Vora is trying to learn how to play Vora. Vora is kind of tricky. I, I tried her out and didn't really click with her at all. I get like what she wants to do, but uh, she kind of plays like a hunter with an assassin ult. It's really weird. She plays like a smite god a little bit. But she's definitely a high res inspired like Ira has made this character and those are the kind of characters they like to make he's like a ranged flank Their Ash versus our whole team. <laughs> Fatality! Point has fallen. Why are you shooting at me? 
Yeah, and they're just protecting her because they know. They know she's their workhorse right now. Uh, life rip morale boost. You gotta get in there and try to help her. Uh, why? You shouldn't have trusted me. Dude. Arvora has no items, by the way. Uh, that's pretty hard to do. Because even by default, it buys items for you. It means she turned that shit off and goes and said, Hey, you know what? I don't, I don't think I really need this. I got the ash! And then I got killed right after. But the, I grabbed the snack, got the execution. Never forget. Oh, I'm happy. I'm trying to watch. Savage. What is this Bora doing? I don't think she understands. Your whole kit is ranged, except for your ult. Like, that's, that's it. Ah, uh, Octavia. I think she's trying to hit her ult, but she doesn't know how. Vora's ult is kind of just a single target execution and really actually uh, lame. Oh, I saw the effect. I saw the effect there. It's like 400 to 2. Two other people. Oh, that's good. The talent works. It just doesn't feel like it's helping me that much. Please leave me alone. I'm getting hunted. Okay, we're going to switch over to Siege. And I think I'm going to stick with the Toot talent, because it just actually feels like I'm doing something in the game. Alright, this is game number one of Siege. We're going to play five games of Siege. And probably one game of death net. <laughs> da -da -da, da -da -da. Siege. <laughs> Just making champion. sure you're paying attention, chat. All right. OG. Customize your champion. Let's go purple. Purple turtle. Y'all never seen a purple turtle? What's up with that? Always AFK. Awesome. Great. This guy's got like a mastery or something with Grok. That's impressive, dude. Okay, I'm ready. Got that level 22. Oh my, is this the same team? Bora, Ash, Octavia. Ugh, still the same core. I guess that's working if people are doing it. Is that a level 69 Ash? 69 lol
How is this balanced? The person's level 69. I'm like, level 6. <laughs> I feel like, I don't know, hi res Maybe did fix the matchmaking on some of your games. I don't know. Just a suggestion, you know? The Monka. What the Monka S? Loading the screen is unhealthy. Taking too long. Hey, wake up, you lazy lizard! I defy these earthly bonds. All right. Aim deal oh. all day. No, you can't eat it. The only thing <laughs> I like to change is the talent. Uh, but we're gonna stick with two, because it's just makes more effective. Especially in Siege, where we need to make a push. Octavia Prepare has the, uh, the healing card, I guess? Or the healing talent? Yep. Where she lands, and it gives her, like, an area of heals. We got a lot of heals, especially if this Grok is as good as he looks. <laughs> And he looks good. Five, mm, mm, mm. Four, that is juicy. Three, two, one. So That's a it juicy begins. character right there. An enemy has drawn first blood. Oh, ow. Yeah. Oh, she's so low! I gotta watch out for that Vora, man. spaghetti -o. Apparently Sky was on the list of easiest characters? Really? Is Sky really that easy? I'm just not good at like... The stealthy, fast characters. It's just not... It's not me. It's not my style of gameplay at all in anything ever. I mean, she's... She's annoying. I don't know if she's really that great as a champion. this back to where it belongs got our backs. yeah they get one point from capturing it and another point for bringing it to where it needs to go that's a good octavial right there boys thank you Oops. hold on something's happening Alright, I got distracted. I got distracted, Dan. Aww, oh, that sucked. Sorry, it says somebody set off my alarm, but I think it's just, uh, like, the town garbage truck or something. Garbage day, it's Friday. 
It's enemy. garbage it's day and I'm playing it's like garbage. How's that person still on? There we go. <laughs> what the hell is that? Octavia in the back line there. I don't think I can out snipe an Octavia, guys. You need the two Octavias to start a fight. See which one is better. Hopefully it's mine. I'll stay on the payload and try to move it back by myself. Three, two, one. Why would you waste your ult? Just hold on to it. That was the end of the round. What the, what the heck? Ultimate is down. Ultimate is down. Yeah, they have a Dragos, but I didn't really notice him doing much. I'm sure he's doing something. He's just not the problem. The problem is the Vora and the Octavia for me. And then I guess also the sky is being annoying, but if I can hit her, she's pretty much dead because she's squishy. I'm over. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Let's go, gamers. Head out. We're about to spin on these fidgets. Out. I would like to ult somebody today. That would be good. I could like stay alive long enough to do that. It would mean a lot to me. We have to get this capture though. It would have been a waste to ult there. Like, if somebody's at one health, why would I ult them, you know? Somebody hitting me from behind? What's going on? I don't see anybody. Hey, guess what? I just ate you. Ah, bitch! That's how you play flank right there. Just walk right up to them, <laughs> and they won't notice you. Oh, that that still kills me. I thought it would I would survive the whole thing, but it no. nope. That's alright, we got the push and that's all that matters. Three to one right now. Let's get this cap point and let's win. You're out of this world. Let's win. Let's win it. Buck is doing good, Octavia is doing good. Everybody there is about seventy percent ready with their ult. We got the Genos ult. 
Oh, or I can like snipe through the Point map. Spawning in 15 seconds. Ah. Five, four, three, <laughs> two, one. Group up! Attack the objective! Attack the Group objective! Up. Group up! We're actually gonna go the other way. We're gonna go this way. Flank around this way. Them before they can even get here. Alright, distracted them. My team should be gaining points. Why did the whole team come off of the point, dude? Stay on the point, team! What are you doing? <laughs> it's like they all saw what I was doing and were like, that's a good idea, let's try that. Stop, what are you, why? What? Stand on the thing! Victory! Thank you. Good <laughs> game! I was frenzied, whatever that means. I think that means I got a couple multi kills. Siege. Select your champion. Customize your champion. All right, We've got another Octavia. Serious for the heels. I'd really, dude, just pick a front line, please, somebody. Thank you. Okay, I'm ready. They have a con. Now, depending on the map, that might be really good. Jaguar Falls. There, there is a way to throw people off of the map, but we're never gonna be over there. We're never gonna be off to the left. There's a small space you can throw people off, but. Uh, I don't think you know what map it's going to be until the game starts, so it's unfortunate for that con, man. I feel for you, buddy. I know. I know what it's like. Con was only good when third person was a thing. Those are just the facts. No, we I'm spitting the truth, and I'm going to be spitting with... Two. It's magic, I think. All right, here we go. Look at this lineup. Number twelve. It's Terminus, and playing running back. The it's is about to begin. Cirrus. Number sixty-nine. Burger King for lettuce. <laughs> That's the lineup. We're ready to play. Five, four. Is this a new Leanne skin? I don't recognize that. The skin. battle has begun. Although I'm not super familiar with all the skins in the game, so I don't know. Leanne is pretty good. I played her. I wasn't good with her, but I think she is good. First blood. 
I can heal myself by running away. Hey, guess what? I'm behind you. Yeah, this is an easy map to flank on. The whole map is designed for flanks, I think. I don't want to stick to this side because I think the con can throw me off here, but. Thank you, soldier. Let's go faster. I can get the more out of here. Yagaroth? Where's he at, dude? I saw him like once. What's he doing? You ever see champions on the other team and you're like, what is that person doing with that champion? Like, it's hard to play Yagaroth and not be the, the problem. Like, he is a problem. And you have to focus him. I, I cannot 1v1 you. I've opted to not. Uh, yeah, I can't. Okay. <laughs> I think Bora just beat Moji 1v1. <laughs> it's felt that way all day. That person must know. Like, I do the damage, but she's just too fast and zooms all over the place. Yeah, see, I can kill her, but. Oh. I didn't even see the con over there. Should I get Wrecker? I mean, it's only one guy with the shields. It's only con with the shields, so probably not. But maybe. Maybe. Uh, I hate you. <laughs> Enemy killing spree. That person probably said the same thing about me. You know, they were probably like, "Wow, I can't believe this guy's playing Moji." <laughs> what an easy champion! How dare you? I don't think it works. I tried to ult him. I ulted him, right? It didn't work. I don't think it works on Yagaroth. Three, two, one. Overtime. He's supposed to be immune. He is CC immune. Does it count as CC? It's it should just polymorph him either way. Cycle. <laughs> it's just like, alright, I guess I'm ulting somebody else on the team now. Their whole team's on fire. This is not good for us. I have a good lineup, but I just think... We gotta try something new. We need a new plan. I need to <laughs> let the Vora go in and focus on somebody else. That's a tanky team, the Yagaroth, Grover, and Khan. A lot Five, of tankiness. Four, three, a lot two, of defense. One. Let's go faster! Don't like this at all. The spirits 
What the fuck was that? What just happened to me? Hello? <laughs> I don't understand what that was. I Alright, I guess I got a headshot of there. Jeez. Jeez, this Octavia ain't this team is not messing around. An enemy is unstoppable. Overtime. Devora can't play alone. I gotta find that Grover though. Enemy killing spree. There he is. Get off of me. Have my own. I gotta eat somebody. There we go. Uh, I got the Grover. I ate the con, but the Yargoth is there spitting on me. Hit yeah, a point into kill the heal point into life rip. Get back into the game, and we're trying to hold on to this. This is not easy though. Group of them. The whole team's here. Terminus, did he ult in there and not get anybody? How? Is this ult really that bad now? God, that sucks, man. He was reviving. I thought that was it. That was, should have been a penta. Why would they nerf that ult, man? I don't get it. Harris makes weird decisions. Like, let's nerf an ult that's so circumstantial. Like, he might get it once or twice a match, but it's not gonna... It's not like a game-changing ult. It's just really good. Really good when it goes off. Or it was really good. It's not like, It's not good anymore. 15 seconds remaining. Yeah, I think this is... I mean, we got the point, but we're not moving this payload an inch. Oh, I didn't pick up the snack. Damn it, I tried, but I think he, he hid behind somebody else there. He keep up. I tried so far and got so hard. I guess, I mean, we have the points, I might as well get the shield breaking. <laughs> Gro uh, Grover's the issue. It's like everyone on their team is just feels like they know what they're doing. They're all building and healing. Point spawning in 15 seconds. <laughs> uh, 
They don't really have a healer, so I mean, well, they have Grover, but five looks like four, Grover's three, two, lap and one. Rover's too busy slapping me to heal the team. Well, that would have worked if anybody paid attention. Uh, where's the Leanne? There was a free window there, bro. Enemy killing spree. Ouch! Just spawned in. Somebody do something! Terminus, you have no health. If you're gonna go die, you're mine. do it in a group. And then off! Please! Like, I know you got nerfed, but. You can at least try. Oh my god, what? Did that really stun me there? This is it. This is for the tie. They're on it. They're on it. They're on it. Come on! Yes! Alright, we have to push this. We don't have a choice. Ignore the Yaragos. It's the rest of the team that's the issue. Put that all down. It ate him. Snacked on him. Chomped on him. Let's go. I feel it in my bones. I'm radioactive right now. We're making it. We're doing the thing. The thing is happening. Oh, and then I got sniped. <laughs> this is the most we've done in the whole game. Go, buddy, go. <laughs> I want it. I want it. This is only game two of Siege, isn't it? Holy poof. This is going the distance. I heard the terminus all, but I didn't see anyone die in the kill feed, so... Ah, oh, they all focus me! I've been injured. I've been injured by this video game. Injuring my brain. Dude, holy poop! 15 seconds remaining. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Would be a great five, time for a Leanne ult. 3, 2. He's got it. 1. Push them back! And well. Enemy double kill. I'm on it! Behind us. I need healing. 
<laughs> I polymorphed her, but I couldn't chomp the bits. Oh no, dude, the tiebreaker. I have to flank to the left, and I know they're gonna they're gonna see me doing this. But I don't have a choice. This is do or die right here. Point spawning in 15 Rupa. seconds. <sighs> Let's look at that Grover out. Woohoo. That should be the focus. Five. Four, Take the Grover three, out. So they don't two, have the heals. One. All right, Octavia's gone. Rover's here. Rover's gone. Ton's low. Ton's gone. Let's go, let's go. That's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. That's, it. that's game, that's game, that's game. Hold. Yagarok's gonna come in alone. But we're on the point. Just ignore the Yagarov completely. Attendee's not even there. Holy shit, we're doing it. Break your shield. Break that shield, boy. Oh, oh what did it end? Oh. We did it. We did the thing. That was great. That felt good. We had a plan. The plan was to flank. I won the 1v1 versus the Octavia, and then I got in, and Grover was there, and I eliminated the Grover, and from there, that was all she wrote. That was a perfect example of playing flank. Like, playing your role. Take out the damage dealer, then focus the healer, and then the rest of the team is whatever. Whew. All right, that was only game two. <laughs> we still have three more Siege games to go. This will be game three. but he didn't make it. Siege. Choose your champion. Customize your champion. Locked in. Look at that. Flank. Flank. Damage. Damage. No support. Oh! 
Oh, I just sometimes I imagine that everybody else on the team is doing like a paladin stream of like a specific champion with a specific build. <laughs> like they're doing the same thing I'm doing. That guy's over there. Today we'll be playing con full cooldown or whatever. Seeing if he's still relevant in the meta. And that guy's like, we're just playing Bounce House Buck. You know what it is. Because <laughs> if you're not playing Bounce House, if you're not playing Bully Buck, like if you're not doing the Slam Jam Space Jam shit with Buck, then you're playing him wrong. <laughs> that's, just, that's, that's just the truth, man. You got a meme build with that character. You, ha you kind of just have to. The champion's made to be a meme. The Bach is a paladins, dude. Go in there and bounce on people all day. Hey, wake up, you lazy lizards! Let's try the boom boom in this one. Um. I won't be getting the healing, but... Oh, hi. I'll be doing the damage. Prepare for battle. Roger. Hell a bad joke. I'm on it. Let's see if I have a joke for today. Oh, hi. Five, four, three, two, eight, one. Right. And so it begins. Um. First blood. Hmm. Trying to find a good one. These are all really bad. These are all real bad. For the house, I stand stalwart. Stop the payload. Why did the troll fall be back careful. with his army? He didn't want to be, be ogre run by the enemy. Team, uh, I think didn't we tell this one before? I feel like we did. With me team. With me team. With me well, team. Well, there it is. <laughs> it's out there again in the world. I think I got disconnected from this game, guys. Yeah, I got disconnected. Y'all made me focus on the the jokes and not the game. Try to get back in here. Let the battle begin. Oh, my game's like frozen. Oh, there we go. What the hell was that about? Ah, the bot got two kills. The Moji bot, when I left, got two kills. Incredible! I don't even you don't even have to play this champion! Just let the bot take over, dude. 30 seconds remaining. Oh. 
They were coming for me. Fifteen seconds remaining. Enemy double kill. Nine. What do you get when you cross a fishing lure with a gym saw? A hook, line, and stinker. This is Fubar. Point spawning in fifteen seconds. Puss left. Puss left. Five, four, Puss three, left. two, With me, team. one. Yeah, I have to. I have to change the points on that one because you guys use it like thirty times a day. And it takes me time to either think of a joke or look one up on the list of random jokes I have here. And I'm dead. And the whole team's dead. The whole team got wiped! Like a butt! You said that already, underdog. You gotta come up with new lines. Yeah, well, my team sucks. How about that? Overtime. This is a throwaway game at this point. Enemy double kill. I just don't see how I can get there. change our strategy. play boy oh hey how's it going now I did a thing in the game help that was like a skyrim moment dude
Alright, well, I updated the, the joke reward now. So get wrecked, everybody. Now, 900 points. 900 power points. Every three minutes. The three minute cooldown, because you guys, like, the other stream I did, people were spamming it, and it's just like, oh my gosh. You made me lose. You made me lose the game! Which is not supposed to be part of the reward. <laughs> Drop the controller. New point reward. Okay, this is game four of Siege. Siege. Select the life steal emoji, and I'm I'm sorry. What? Excuse. It, it, my battle pass is gone. My all the champions are now locked. What? Hello. Alright, well, thanks for watching Paladins. What the fuck just happened? Is this because I went AFK? Is this my punishment? Why did this happen? I don't have enough gold. Or crystals to purchase Moji. I can't play Moji for the rest Ten of the stream. Seconds remaining. What? How does this happen? Is this a glitch? My game glitched out. Customize your Cassie. champion. It gave me Cassie. Yeah, I think I'm done. <laughs> I can't reset my game unless I end the stream. So I think we broke Paladins today. Let's go see what Chadley's doing. We'll be back with Paladins next Friday. I'll be playing uh some version of Ruckus. I'm not sure if we want full ammo, full cooldown, full health, full shield. I'm not really sure what we want to do with Ruckus. I'll find a build for him. Uh, probably one we've already done before, but we can go back and maybe find a new build for Ruckus. We could do that. That would be cool, right? So, uh, sorry that my game's all glitched out. I'm definitely not playing Cassie now. My battle pass is just gone. My battle pass and my champion pass are just gone. So there's no point in me continuing the stream any longer. Greetings, we'll steal these drugs. 